Your daughters are so gorgeous. Oh, thank you. And you look exactly the same as you did in high school. He, he doesn't age. It's uh, good genes, I guess. And Lois, I read all your stories. I mean, it's so impressive. Because of you, I tell my girls they can do anything. Thank you. Are you still at the bank? Yeah. And Kyle's still at the firehouse, made fire chief last year, and everybody else we know moved away. She means bailed. Lewick? Twin Cities. Sippy? St. Louis. Maybe you'll see him at the next reunion? Ken didn't make it to the last one now, did he? Uh, I was supposed to, but we... You know, it used to be that uh, when folks move away to get their degrees, well, they'd bring their skills back home, take care of the community's help, raise them, you know? That ain't happening anymore. Well, okay, we'll uh, at least get a lifeline if this whole Edge proposal goes through, right? What does Morgan Edge want with Smallville? Oh, boy. He's retrofitting the cold mines to produce alternative energies. It's gonna put a lot of folks back to work around here. Until it doesn't. Lewis. Morgan Edge ruins everything he touches. What's he ruined? He is single-handedly destroying the Daily Planet. People quit reading that paper because uh, you reporters can't keep your politics to yourselves. Edge's companies prey on struggling communities. He busts up unions. He barely pays a living wage. I don't understand how he can keep fooling people. Oh, you mean us dumb, backward, small-town folk? No, no, that is not what I meant. I know what you meant. See, people like you, you, you look at Smallville and, and you think of the past and you feel a little bad for us, right? People like Morgan Edge, though. Now, see, he looks at Smallville and he sees the future. It's not a future I would want to live in. It's a good thing we don't have to worry about that anymore, now, do we?